The cultural arm of the United Nations has accepted Palestine as a fully fledged member. It's the first time Palestinians have achieved full status to any UN body. But UNESCO could pay for its decision with a major cut in funding. Let's now cross live to YT's Daniel Bushel, who will explain all of this further. Daniel, so uh, over two thirds of UNESCO members pre are present uh, there voted in favor of omitting Palestine. But the US has now vowed to cut over 20% of the agency's budget. Why is this? Well, Washington says that this uh, vote goes against its jurisdiction and Israel's foreign minister uh, said that Israel does oppose uh, any such bid by Palestine to the UN uh, body, but uh, it doesn't have much leverage. Uh, Israel doesn't have much political or financial leverage on the world uh, stage in such uh, actions like this one. Now, the United States and Israel are considered allies and in practice, Washington does tend to back Israel and uh, enforce its decisions on the world stage. Now, Daniel, um, the, uh, the Palestinians had already gained elevated status of observer entity at the UN General Assembly. Do, do, do you think today's admission to UNESCO uh, could have any bearing on Palestine's bid for full UN membership? Yes, it's the clearest indication so far that uh, the United States will veto any such application by Palestine uh, at next month's meeting. There is a meeting next month of the UN Security Council if Palestine does go ahead with its full uh, bid. Now, today's vote uh, does bring Palestine a, a step closer to full membership, but so long as the United States maintains its total opposition, there seems little chance uh, for it to get to that goal. Uh, last month, Palestine did lodge a full application with the United Nations. Uh, but with the U U.S. opposition so far uh, saying that it will oppose any such bid by Palestine for its own state. All right, our artist, uh, Daniel Bush, there live in Brussels. Thank you. All right, well, uh, we are always uh, interested in your opinion, so we are asking you right now, uh, what does Palestine's acceptance to UNESCO mean? Uh, head to rt.com to take part in our latest web poll. Uh, looking at the numbers right now, uh, the vast majority believe it uh, changes very little for Palestinians on the ground. Uh, the second most popular is the view that it paves the way for statehood. Uh, and there's a tie between those who say it sweetens the pill of future rejection by the UN and those who think that now UNESCO will have trouble paying its bills. Uh, do go online and cast your vote.